Okay, today we're going to be giving IV medication push to our patients who are running IV line. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to check my order, make sure the medication I want to give, which in this case is morphine, that it's compatible uh, with my IV solution, and that I can give it IV push, how much I have to dilute it with, and how long to infuse it over. So I've got my morphine, I've got my ticket on my morphine, so I know that this is morphine, okay, and I can, I've got one milligram of morphine in here, and it's supposed to be diluted, and so what I've figured out, it's going to take four to, it take five minutes to infuse, I've got five mils in here, so every minute I'm going to put in 0.1 of a mil. So my IV line is running, my site looks good, it's infusing well, it doesn't look like it's... Uh, Infiltrated into the into the skin. Okay, I'm going to alcoholize my um, my port. I've done my checks. I've checked my more. I have checked. I've done my three checks. Make sure this is the right patient. My right reasons for giving the morphine. So I'm going to leave my IVs running. It's still infusing. Okay, I'm going to, 30 seconds. I'm going to let it dry. Okay, I've got my syringe of morphine. I'm going to give 0.1 every minute for five minutes. I'm going to. Okay, I'm going to put it in here. I'm going to have my watch with my minute hand. So my, I'm going to pinch my tubing. And I'm going to instill 0.1 of a mil. And I'm going to unclamp my tubing. I'm going to wait the minute as it's going through. Okay, and then after a minute, I'm going to clamp the tubing again. Put the next 0.1 in. Keep this open for a minute. A minute later, I'm going to flush it again, my point one. Let it infuse for a minute. Okay, and then I'm going to put my next point one in. Oh, unkink my tubing, let it infuse. Okay, and then my final point one. Okay, I'm going to wait my minute. Now I'm going to flush it because I want to make sure I get all the, all the medication out of this port here. I'm going to use a three mil syringe, pre-filled syringe. I'm going to take off the top. Always pull back and make sure you get all the air out of there so you're not injecting any air. And this one is totally empty. Okay, let's try another one. This is why we get the air out of the syringe. Okay, pull back and make sure you have no air in your syringe and I'm going to infuse it at the same rate that I did my medication which is 0.1 of a mil every minute so I'm going to pinch the tubing instill one mil okay unclamp my tubing leave it open for a minute then I'm going to clamp my tubing again another minute run my IV for a minute and then one more time I'm going to clamp my tubing instill my medication